While trying to buy the best sound bars on the market can be difficult, and that's why we are here to assist you, and these are our recommendation for the best six products on the market. Don't forget to check out the description below for more information and prices. Sonos Arc The Sonos Arc is a premium sound bar that delivers impressive sound quality and innovative features for any Sony smart TV. It supports Dolby Atmos, which creates a 3D sound experience with two up-firing speakers and five phased array channels that bounce sound off the walls and ceiling. The ARC can also be paired with a wireless subwoofer and rear speakers to create a complete home theater system. We found the ARC's sleek and elegant design matches well with most TVs. It is about the length of a 55-inch TV, but is not too thick or tall to fit easily on a wall or a TV stand. Overall, the ARC has a well-balanced sound profile, clear dialogue, and accurate instruments, but some listeners may need more bass. One of the unique features we love about the ARC is TruePlay, which uses your iOS device's microphone to measure your room's acoustics and adjust the sound output accordingly. You can also utilize the Sonos apps to access other settings, such as speech enhancement, night mode, and volume control. Bang & Olufsen Bio Sound Stage The Bang & Olufsen Bio Sound Stage brings an audio quality consistent with the company's other premium-sounding products. It sounds great for movies as well as for music. There's plenty of connectivity on hand so you can center a whole entertainment system around it as well, though as with all things B&O, it costs about a month's rent. It's no surprise that the Bang & Olufsen Bio sound stage sounds amazing, and you'll be happy to know that it sounds just as good for music as it does for the latest Sandra Bullock movie. More surprising is that the company has taken a page out of the Sonos playbook and made it capable of integrating with other B&O speakers for a multi-room setup or even for a more surround sound type of setup. The soundbar is extremely expensive, and getting extra speakers for that spatial audio will add an additional cost that most will want to avoid springing for. But if you can splurge, this well-designed, minimalist-looking soundbar is worth consideration, especially since it also has enough connectivity to be used as the center of any of an entertainment center. It even includes an HDMI 2.1 ARC pass-through port, so you can connect that next-gen console and still get 4K at 120Hz performance on your fancy TV. Creative Stage V2 The Creative Stage V2 2.1 soundbar with subwoofer is a premium audio solution designed to enhance your TV viewing experience. With its sleek designs and advanced features, it delivers immersive sound with clear dialogues and surround effects and is equipped with Sound Blaster technology, this soundbar ensures high-quality audio reproduction. Its built-in subwoofer provides deep bass for a rich and impactful sound experience. The clear dialogue feature enhances the dialogue clarity, making it much easier to follow conversations in movies and TV shows. This is a fairly stripped-down affair, as you won't see features like Dolby Atmos or voice assistant support. Plus, its glossy finish is a bit of a dust magnet, but at least the Creative Stage Vi 2 has decent connectivity, including an HDMI ARC port, optical in, and Bluetooth connectivity. Again, considering the price, the Creative Stage Vi 2 offers much more than you would expect. The adjustable bass and treble controls allow you to fine-tune the sound according to your preferences. With its genuine features and thoughtful design, the Creative Stage Vive 2 2.1 soundbar with subwoofer is the perfect addition to any TV setup, delivering immersive audio and enhancing your overall entertainment experience. Samsung WQ700B The Samsung WQ700B is powerful, with plenty of clarity, and just as importantly, it supports both Dolby Atmos and DTS for an immersive home theater experience. The soundbar comes with some amazing features, though some, like Q-Symphony, require pairing the soundbar with a relatively new Samsung TV. If you own a Samsung TV made within the last few years, there may not be a better soundbar than the Samsung HWQ700B, as it can use the TV's speakers in conjunction with its own speakers via the Q-Symphony feature for a massive sound. Even without that, its support for Dolby Atmos and DTS means you'll get a massive and immersive listening experience which can be heightened if you choose to invest in some additional rear speakers. And some great features are available such as wireless TV connectivity, 4K and HDR supported HDMI connectivity, and voice assistant support if you own an Amazon Echo device. The HWQ700B also has adaptive sound modes to cater to whatever type of media you're consuming, whether it's sports, news, or a blockbuster movie. JBL Bar
5.1 The JBL Bar 5.1 is surprisingly cheap looking for its formidable price tag. It's mostly plastic in its design, and while it feels robust, the buttons and screen aren't as slick as you'll find on competitors like the Bose SoundTouch 300. The main body of the soundbar is wrapped in a perforated mesh and disguises a small display that sits underneath it, just to the right of a small JBL logo. On top are four manual buttons for power, volume, and input source. Around the back are a number of different inputs, three HDMI ports, one USB, one AUX, and one optical. The soundbar stands at 58 mm tall, meaning it'll comfortably fit in front of most TVs, although it's clearly designed to be attached to a wall underneath a screen. The box includes everything needed to fasten the JBL Bar 5.1 to the wall. When connected as one unit, the JBL Bar 5.1 sits at 1148 mm, which is wide for a sound bar, so if you are considering making the purchase, it's worth ensuring you've got the space for it. The JBL Bar 5.1 can also be paired to a device over Bluetooth for wireless music playing, allowing it to double up as a Bluetooth speaker. A button on the remote will enable you to easily swap backward and forwards between a wired and Bluetooth connection. The JBL Bar 5.1 is difficult to give a definitive verdict on. On the one hand, we're loath to recommend a device that handles music the way that it does, but at the same time, we were so impressed with the ease of turning a sound bar into a completely wireless surround sound system that we have to recommend it. Polk Magnify Mini AX The Polk Magnify Mini AX is a bit pricey for such a small sound bar, and its Dolby Atmos leaves something to be desired. But this diminutive soundbar actually sounds great, helped along by its wireless subwoofer. It's also attractive, but you'll want to be careful with placement as it's tall enough to block the IR receiver on your TV. Many small soundbars are a definite upgrade from TV speakers, but generally not more than that. However, that's not the case with the Polk Magnify Mini AX, as it actually has pretty impressive audio for its size. It also has plenty of rumble because of an included subwoofer, and although it has Dolby Atmos support, that's middling. Still, there are a variety of sound modes to help you make the most of your TV's audio. The design on the Polk Magnify Mini FX is somewhat unusual. Coming in an attractive package on the taller side, it's tall enough to potentially block the IR receiver on your TV. So if you decide to grab it, be careful with your placement. At least the subwoofer, which is also a bit unique with its tall and thin look, is wireless. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and want to hear more from us, please subscribe to our channels and please hit the bell icon to get notified of our new videos.